Hey Fruit Bats, it's Frilly the Banana Girl here. Today is day 27 of my 30 videos in 30 days. And today's topic is on how to get lean, sexy, toned arms. Okay, I think I'm pretty qualified on the subject because I have pretty lean arms and I've come from having pretty, you know, chubby, fluidy, fatty arms. Okay, so they've leaned up a whole lot and I am going to give you my best tips so you can also achieve similar results because it's not really as hard as a lot of people think. And I remember trying to get lean arms for so, so long but not knowing the correct recipe and never ever getting them. I only ever got leaner when I was restricting my calories but I'd always bounce back, binge out and put the weight back on my arms. So as you can see they're pretty toned and lean and I'm not doing a heck of a lot for them but something that I'm doing which is really really important which a lot of you guys out there know already is eating a clean diet okay so eating a clean diet is so so important and it has to be done consistently and what I mean by clean diet is a low insulin low sodium diet so fructose does not require insulin to be released in the body so you want a high fructose diet a high fruit diet is best, aka a high carb raw vegan or high carb cooked vegan diet. Okay, so the raw to four program. Have a lot of fruit during the day and then have your high carb cooked meal or have fruit and vegetables raw all day. That is the best for leaning out and toning up the arms. And a lot of people think that, you know, it's all about spot reducing, you know, you can do exercises and you're going to get lean arms from those exercises like, you know, bicep curls and stuff like that. I mean, that's great and I also recommend them, but they're not exactly going to lower your overall body fat and that's what you want to do. So what is really, really good for that is doing HGH sessions, high intensity sessions, a couple of times a week. That's a really speedy way to get you to lower your body fat. So you can see the video that I made on the subject here. This is what I do and this really, really works. It has done for quite a while for me. So try it, definitely. And harking back to the diet, low sodium is so important because salt holds a hundred times its weight in water in your body. So a lot of people have tons of fluid rippled throughout their arms, throughout their muscles, making them appear big and bloated and quite fat. And people often think that that's just pure fat. Oh, I've got really fat arms. It's all, you know, this body fat. But a lot of time it's a lot of fluid. So cutting down the salt in your diet is so important. And I've been doing that for a long time and I'm reaping the benefits from it. I mean, it's not hard to do that and you get a new set of taste buds every 10 days so you'll start to really enjoy your low sodium diet. But you know what makes it most, most tasty is when you see the results in your arms, when you see them starting to lean out. So you want to lower the fats, okay? Lower the fat in your diet so you're having below 10% of daily calories from fat. Work it out at chronometer.com. Do this consistently. It isn't going to happen overnight. I'm not making that promise. This isn't a fad diet. I'm not trying to sell you any supplements or anything like that. This is just something you need to do consistently to stay on track. Okay, so the next thing, so we've got HGH sessions. Do that a couple times a week. You want to lower the body fat percentage. And I also recommend some toning tools. Toning, I use that term loosely, but these sort of exercises are great for firming up the skin and making the arms appear leaner as well. So this is my resistance band. It's quite thick. This is actually the heaviest one that you can get. You can get thin ones, but it's kind of like you're doing, you know, pink dumbbells. It's not doing a lot. So you want to get in the gym if you can and do some heavy resistance, you know, like a five, six rep maximum on your arms and that will give you some nice tone in your arms and you'll see results quite quickly that way. Or you can do it at home, you know, put your foot on the resistance band and yeah, just do your bicep curls. And you can do, you know, you should really go to failure, you know, at about five, six reps. So make it hard enough, you know, that you have to really push to get it up. Don't sacrifice your form, they keep your chest up. So if you do say, you know, five reps, five, six, seven reps on each arm, about three sets of that a couple of times a week, maybe every second day, you're gonna see results eventually, but you gotta stick with it. And something that I 
I really, really recommend is doing some chin-ups. They're excellent. Buy a chin-up bar, you know, get assistance if you can't do a chin-up because it is quite hard, but do assisted chin-ups. They're fantastic for leading the arm, making the arms, you know, look a lot leaner, get building the muscle in there because you want to build that muscle, fills out the skin and it makes the arms look nice and sculpted. So, and also push-ups. Push-ups are really, really good as well. And believe it or not, doing squats is good for your arms as well because it helps build muscle in the largest group of your body, which is your legs, your quads. The more muscle you build in your quads, the higher your metabolic rate, the more calories, the more fat you're burning at rest, and the leaner your arms are going to be. So isn't that pretty cool? You can get you know, leaner indirectly through your, arm, through your legs. Leaner arms through your legs. So it's pretty cool. And just try it. That's all I'm saying. Give it your best shot. Be consistent. Remember that you didn't get to where you are. Your arms didn't get to how fat or fluidy they are overnight and it's not going to happen overnight for them to get lean. This has been a consistent effort, low insulin, low sodium, low fat diet for years now. So just get on the program, you will see results. And don't forget to go fruit or root yourself today. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow for day 28. Bye. Banana girl. Go free to yourself.